navigation another shot. If you guys remember my last video, I tried the contour and the scrunch balm, and I'm not gonna lie guys, I wasn't totally sold on them, but you let me know in those comments, girl, what are you doing? You need to try the camo or the solid. Well, I couldn't get my hands on the solid. I still can't, I don't, I don't know why, but they're always sold out. But nevertheless, I do have the camo here. So I'm coming at you with a nice little fierce, fresh, tiny review of the Navigation camo leggings. I got a spicy orange color here. I was gonna get a few, but your girl's not made of money, so I just had to stick with one. It's the same print, just different freaking colors after all, so what the hell. It was a tough decision picking the color, but I recall Ashley Jordan rocking the bright AF orange leggings, so I had to too. But if you are new, definitely subscribe to this channel. We do active wear reviews every single week. And if you are a fan of navigation, then you're gonna like what's coming up. I actually snagged a few of their new wild thing pieces that just launched, all that animal print, yeah. So that'll be the next navigation video coming up, but we also do love taking requests on this channel. So if you do have a request for an activewear brand, drop it below. I got a list and I check it twice. Gotta find out which activewear is good and nice. <laughs> Let's do this. Okay, I'm shook at how different the camo fit than the other two leggings that I tried from them. It's insane. It's like two totally different animals here. This is a really comfortable legging. Like every single aspect of this legging is so stretchy. Nothing's getting sandwiched. I got a lot of extra room going on back here. There's nothing that pisses me off more than a legging that sandwiches in my glutes. There's barely any material here. And then I look flat as a freaking pancake. So actually Jordan's got it going on in this department here with these. Totally true to size. My size small is really working for this because any smaller, I think it'd be a little tighter around the glute area. So I'm, I'm gonna stick with this size. It's actually a really soft legging overall, but you can feel a little bit of that slight texture from the camo. This is definitely the stretchiest thing I've ever worn from them. And I am somebody who values stretch over anything. I swear that is so important to me or else why even wear a legging? It's definitely a lower to moderate type of compression. Really nice length. If you guys see me looking in this direction, it's because I'm looking at my full length mirror that's leaning against my kitchen counter because that is how I roll in this apartment. So yeah guys, I actually wore these to the gym the other day. Of course I didn't get a picture in it. Like my mind didn't even think to snag a selfie, go figure. But Bay was checking me out hard. I saw him at the gym over there. He kept looking up my glutes. But he did say that it wasn't totally squat proof. So there's that. They're like 90, 85, 90% squat proof. There's a little bit of crack, he said. But you know what though? <laughs> this is the point of these reviews. I gotta tell it like it is. But I will say that while working out, I think it was a good hour, hour and a half I worked out. These didn't budge, these didn't slide. There was no gape, there was no awkwardness. It stayed intact so nicely for me. Super wicking, it didn't trap any heat, didn't make me sweat up a storm. It felt very just lightweight, it moved with me, my body. It just kind of glazed over me like a glazed donut. You know what I'm saying? Like that glaze that just drips over a donut, that's how this legging did uh, for me. With that being said, I'm gonna call these my Krispy Kreme legging. I love when a legging is Krispy Kreme. For a gym legging, this is doing it. And for less than $50, like seamless, yeah. I think my favorite thing about this legging, to be honest with you, is the insane stretch and the fact that this doesn't actually have a scrunch bump. All right, this is a camel legging without a scrunch on it but the material just makes its way up there naturally on its own, nothing totally forced. What I find fascinating about this legging is the fact that there is zero contour, no shading whatsoever, not even a raised seam contour down the middle, nothing. No scrunch, you name it, it's not there. But this legging just is so good with its material right here. You see that extra material and stretch? I've said this in other videos where you could literally, you guys taught me this trick where you pull it from the sides right up the glutes and and it's look at this for crying out loud there's so many leggings that are designed similarly to this except they give me a uni butt so for the fact that it does not have a scrunch or anything helping it the material is doing it all by itself 
So I have to give them that. Yeah, guys, I think if, overall, if you're looking for a lower intensity style of legging, you really love those prints and you want something to really emphasize the glutes, then give this one a shot, absolutely. So yeah, guys, thank you very much for suggesting this legging. I know that Navigation and I got off to a little bit of a rough start, but overall, like, yeah, this definitely changed my tune with them. And now I'm even more excited to try the Wild Thing collection because if it's anything like the camo in terms of material and fit, I think we're gonna get along quite well. So definitely stay tuned for that one as soon as it comes in. Hopefully it doesn't take too long because my first order from them took like 10 days, dude, to even ship. But strangely enough, this camo actually came in really fast, a lot faster than the original order. So I don't really know what's going on with the shipping thing, but I'm really hoping that my wild thing comes in like any day now. So yeah, thank you so much for watching. I hope this review helped you a little bit. Definitely stay tuned. We have some really, huh, really fun launches coming your way. So definitely do not forget to subscribe, give this video a like, and drop a comment with your thoughts. What are your thoughts? <laughs> I love y'all so much, and I will catch you next time. All right, so. Do I look like Ashley Jordan when I do this? Did I pull it off? Do I rock it like she does? Come on. Come on. Better. Oh. Oh. Okay. <laughs> but then again, you know, what do you expect? Wait, what the fuck? What is this? So let's go ahead and try this baddie on. I don't know why I keep stretching it. I'm gonna stretch it out. Yeah, so I'm actually wearing my hot red thong underneath here. <laughs> Definitely hit that subscribe button because if you like videos like this, well then you're gonna really like this channel because we do videos just like this on all different types of, wait, no. Look how stretchy this is. Look at this. <laughs> I would never have guessed if my eyes were closed that this would be from the same brand. I love when a legging is Krispy Kreme. <laughs>